Greetings, I'm Sean Bagshaw. Thanks for your interest in my tutorial series called Lightroom Essentials. In the 24 video chapters in these tutorials, containing over five and a half hours of instruction, I guide you through the aspects of Lightroom that are essential for me when working with my images. The tutorials include easy to follow instruction on a wide range of topics including important Lightroom preferences, importing and exporting images, managing a Lightroom catalog, making image collections, organizing and searching images using the library module, creatively developing images using the develop module, producing slideshows, soft proofing, and creating fine art prints. These tutorials are based in Lightroom 5, but a lot of what I teach applies to previous versions of Lightroom and hopefully will remain relevant to versions of Lightroom in the near future as well. While this instruction will be helpful for those who use Lightroom in conjunction with Photoshop or other imaging applications, I produce them first and foremost to illustrate how Lightroom can be used as a standalone application. Hopefully the videos provide just the right information for people who are new to image editing or who want to move to Lightroom from Photoshop, as well as those who have been using Lightroom for some time and just want to brush up on their skills. The videos are broken into chapters by topic. You can watch them from beginning to end or just view individual chapters on selected topics. One of the brilliant things about video is that you can pause it to practice and you can rewind and replay it as often as needed. Different types of photographers will use Lightroom in different ways. These tutorials illustrate the essentials of how I use Lightroom as a landscape and nature photographer. I work on a PC computer, so all the tutorials feature the PC Lightroom 5 interface. If you use a Mac, you will notice some slight differences in some parts of the interface. Whenever possible, I try to point out differences and reference the Mac-specific buttons, menus, and keyboard shortcuts. Mac users should have no trouble following along. Thanks for your interest in learning from me about how I use Lightroom for managing, developing, and showcasing my photographs. I hope that you find these tutorials enlightening and valuable and that they help you get the most out of your images and your use of Lightroom.